Now, the only thing that scares me about all wood houses like this is that it's so easy to set that shit on fire. I just be thinking of crazy Lulu scenario. Go big or go home. Like, this is screaming, I got money. What do you have? I mean, at the end of the day, though, do we really need a gate for the chickens? Because you want free range chickens, right? So, why would you, like, put intentionally your chickens in a cage? What is up guys? My name's The Symbian. My name is Yen. I play The Sims. Did you see what I did there? Yes, you did. Stop playing with me. Anyway, guys, yo, I thought I knew how to build. Turns out, I don't know shit. When I tell you guys ever since the Horse Ranch expansion pack dropped, the builders have been coming out of the blue saying, let's go. I mean, every two seconds, I'm seeing another build on the gallery. When I tell you guys, not the SMB mod popping up. Oops, didn't mean to put that there. But anyway, guys, when I tell you guys that these builders are so talented and so creative, shout out to the builders. We need a round of applause for builders. Because when I tell you guys, they come through every single time when an expansion pack drops and you want an entire new world they got you covered so i'm gonna show you guys some of the most amazing builders that i have seen so far now of course this is not every single amazing builder that i've ever freaking seen in my whole goddamn life but i'm showing you guys some of the really cool ones that i have seen over on twitter and not even that but just tumblr in general like we're gonna just jump right into it and the first one we're gonna go into is the horse ranch do I have cat hair on my shirt? Yes, I do. But at the end of the day, it doesn't matter because we're focused on these bills. So this first one is actually by one of a, a really talented creator by the name of Sims 4 Ideas. When I tell you chef kisses to everything, I mean it. Okay, let's dive deep. Okay, let's 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 take a look at this. When I tell you guys, your Sims can not only live here, but also maybe even make it like a marketplace. Come on now, you guys gotta think, y'all gotta see the vision. I'm seeing the vision. I'm seeing the vision. This looks absolutely amazing. Very gorgeous. Literally just starting off at the top where we can just go ahead and see everything. Now I did places in Brindleton Bay. You probably like like, what the heck? Why Brindleton Bay? At the end of the day, guys, you can place your builds anywhere. I don't want to be too corny and keep placing and keep placing all the lots in the Horse Ranch expansion pack, even though that's, like, literally what the vibe is for the video. But yeehaw out of this conversation if you don't freaking like it. Anyway, look at this, guys. Upon entrance, as you guys can see, we do have some details. Now, it looks automatically like, okay, maybe I should have just placed this in the Horse Ranch. Maybe I should have placed this in Chestnut Ridge. Okay, yeah, I might be right. But at the end of the day, sit down. You're still going to watch. Now, listen. Well, please. I hope so. Um. Anyway, we have this little cute little well. We have some trucks over here. Again, we can even make this little area again you gotta be delusional when you're playing the sims for gameplay because you know they, they ea like to play with us and like make no packs you know ea like to play with us and make no packs for gameplay you know but this is that's a conversation for another day anyway as you guys can see once you uh, like on entrance you can even make this like a cool like little shed area where maybe you sell some goods and like maybe some like farmer stuff or you know milk whatever like the sheeps the goats can even end up creating and then you can end up using that as a market if you go actually inside though it's actually shut up it's a wood shop not a wood shop, but like where you fix like cars and stuff. Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Again, again, storylines, storyline, storyline. This is all I'm saying. I'm saying storylines. Are you? What is down here? This is so detailed. Do you see why I love this builder? Sims for ideas. You did it again because I would never get that idea. Ever do something like that? And you came. This is gorgeous. Top tier. Okay, let's move on. Now, of course, if you're Sims, come on. Like when you're living the horse ranch life, you obviously have to have animals, right? Let's be FFR. So if you come over here, guys, look a perfectly good freaking place for not only your horse. Horses, but if you have children or if you know maybe it's a horse ranch maybe they got too much nectar and they got a little tipsy you know the adult and decided to you know get a little tipsy and do jungle gym boom okay and then you have room for your little chicken areas oh my gosh I am so here for this now of course you you know not only do you have your own shop okay and you got a little kickback area that you can invite all the sims in town to let's take a dive into the house because we're, we're not appreciating the house we're not appreciating the details in the house let's take a look at amazing amazing and I'm gonna keep saying that over and over and over because I don't think you guys are getting it now of course we have some bikes over here for travel purposes because you know not only do we ride our horses we, we ride bikes over here too you know it's called environmental friendly anyway if you guys come over here we are automatically great oh they got money look at all these purses and designs and the, okay the details obviously look they oh they do got money because look at all these awards let's talk about it upon entrance then you come over here you do have this nice little area oh my god this is so <gasps> this is so cute shut up I love the details. This is the thing I love about uh, builders because this is very gorgeous work. And again, you could put this in the horse ranch, you know, chestnut ridge area. But if you don't, I mean, like, come on now. You can, don't be limited to just chestnut ridge just because it's a horse ranch expansion pack. You, you know, our Sims could be everywhere, okay? It's called diversity. Next creator we're gonna get into is Sim Cubies. And when I tell you Sim Cubies has amazing, amazing builds, so definitely go check, check, check out the work. Check out the work, gallery ID, Sim Cubies. Of course, it'll be linked below in the description for the exact way you spell it. But when I tell you guys, this is called the Hey Now Festival, and it's basically meant for your Sims to have a festival. Now, of course, you can place this in um the, the what, what is it called? Chestnut Ridge, but I decided to place it in Brindleton Bay. Look, Brindleton Bay has the vibes, okay? They have the greenery and what we want. So upon entrance, as you guys can see, this is what we're looking at. I think this is absolutely gorgeous like your sims can literally 
Hold on, we're not, you're not seeing the, you're not seeing the vision. I think I need to zoom out. Let's look at the vision. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Are you joking? Are you, your Sims can have so much fun here. I think this is gonna be a, such a cute like addition to like just have fun, hang out and just be around like, be around all your little Sim fams. Okay, so upon entrance, as you guys can see, we are met with a, a restroom, of course. That's something that we're gonna need. Now again, this is great for game. I told you guys, you gotta be delusional. I'm gonna keep reminding you guys because some of you guys be like, there's no gameplay in the Sims. Well, you're clearly not being delusional enough. Okay, you're not being delusional. You gotta be a little delulu. Now, like you come over here, we have some really cool areas for your horses to start practicing. Maybe you, you know, you can do like a like, oh, like let's see if we can win like a competition for best horse or whatever. You know, again, delulu. Now over here, we have some stables where maybe you want to keep your sim or horses, um, you know, tucked away while you go hang out at the party area. So of course, over here we are now. This is dope. I think this is so cool. Okay, so look, if you come over here, now we are met with this area over here look at this the bars the the town now you can see the vision of it every of everyone just like hanging out enjoying the music enjoying the bar like make this a park i think this would be the best opportunity to make this a park because if you make it a park more people will show up and it'll be cool to like you can hire an entertainer and then just overall have that vibe not only that but it is kid friendly we, there, we there's a whole kid section whole kid section over here where your sims can like hang out and then be like okay let me drop the kids off over here you guys have fun okay little charlie and abatha abatha what kind of name is abatha well if your name is abatha Abatha, I ain't judging. I'm, I'm not judging. I meant to say Agatha, but Abatha, you know what a B is cute too. You feel me? Anyway, so if you come over here, of course the kids are here. And then, I mean, come on now. Come on now. Your Sims can like, maybe if, if your Sims a singer and they're a struggling artist out here in the Chestnut Ridge life and they, you know, they decided to come up to the Hey Now stage and make themselves more known for the publicity. If you got the Get Famous, like I said, guys, Delulu, you guys aren't seeing the vision. Okay, so if you come over here, as y'all can, again, there is like this little fun area where you can act like, you know, you're either buying or purchasing merch or just doing overall festivals activities I think this is such a cute like little area and a great way to like showcase you know just different varieties of being able to like make your sims look more alive and more poppin and everything just looks all together just like it literally looks like a cute I love this this is so freaking cute I'm here for it 110% I mean if you guys don't know who these builders are I mean y'all need to get with the program because this is amazing it's amazing and you can't tell me other I said what I said okay so this next one is called ranch for all animals and when I tell you that plum bob kingdom is literally the king of Making big, huge builds that are absolutely amazing. If you guys don't know about the save file that he did, I mean, lately, like, mind freaking blown. You feel me? Anyway, this is called Ranch for All Animals. And yes, we are finally in Chestnut Ridge. For those who don't have the EP, this is what it looks like. I know it looks really bland and, like, there's nothing around. It's because it is. Anyway, thanks to this builder, we now have something to put it in. Now, boom! Okay, that was very dramatic and that was very lame. But okay, now, this is for your Sims to, like, go big or go home. Like, this is screaming, I got money. What do you have? Let, let, let's look at this from a Sims POV as we go and enter right we're we're in we're, we're walking through we're okay and then we come over here we're met with not only the biggest garden of all time so your sim trust me that rags to riches is going in real quick it's gonna end real quick because there's money there's money look at all these crops look at all these crops there's even a little cute little greenhouse look at this this is so freaking cute i'm obsessed i'm obsessed i'm upset five hundred thousand dollars and this is on my horse ranch chest i don't know i tried to rhyme anyway um over here of course is for your cute little horses to go live their horse Horsey life. And over here, you got a horse. You guys, like, we got the little training area. We have the little stables where they can stay in. Y'all are not seeing the vision. Y'all are, y'all aren't hearing me. Y'all are not seeing it. This is absolutely gorgeous. This is, this is like, I'm, yeah, you know what? Y'all might be saying that I'm hyping it up. But at the end of the day, you guys don't, you guys don't understand. I love Plum Bob Kingdom. All of the builds that he makes. I mean, like, everything is just chef kisses. Look at the little stable bed. They all have it. And you can have as many horses as you, well, not as many as you want, but there's like one, two, three. Then, okay. Okay, and then we have the little water whore. Whore. Wow. Wow. Wow, could I not just get that sentence out? Water horse. Um, the the, the water thing for the, wa the for the horses to drink. Okay. Every time I see this, I I be like, you can leave a horse to water, but you can't make it drink. You can lead a horse to water, but you can't make it drink. That's what this reminds me of every single time, and you know, it's just stuck in my head. Okay. If you come over here, this is what I mean. I bet you there's gonna be something in this closet. I bet you, cause that's what builders do every time. They just come through. What did I just? What did I say every time? They think of every. Then if you really wanted to have cows and sheep, I mean, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. This is so cute. This is adorable. I'm upset. Test. 
Also, don't forget in this build that even without this build, this automatically comes with this like huge area for your horses to roam free and roam around. And there's like a stack of hay. You can even like change it up and put something else there. Now, if we come over here, we are met with this like little farm barn life. Now, this is for your chick. This is for your chickens. How freaking cute. Are you kidding me? Go so inside. This is what it's looking like. We have a little chicken coop for the chickens. Um, if you want, I guess you can put a gate right here. And then also a nectar make. This nectar finna be okay. Hold on now, because this is actually gonna be stank. Well, all those chickens. I mean, at the end of the day, though, do we really need a gate for the chickens? Because you're gonna get your eggs, right? You want free, you want free, free, uh, what do you call it? Free range chickens? You want free range chickens, right? So, why would you like put intentionally your chickens in a cage? Now we're gonna get to the money maker. Are you kidding me? This is the house. This is humongous. What is this? A freaking Airbnb? Okay, let's, let's, let's look into it. Let's, let's look into it. Now, the only thing that scares me about all good houses like this is that it's so easy to set that shit on fire. I just be thinking of crazy Lulu scenario where somebody could just and then your your house is done your house was done it's done it's over now over here we are automatically greeted with this how freaking gorgeous is this this is beautiful oh my gosh this has everything you need i mean it's just giving the woodsy vibes it's giving like i want a rancher soft life and to just be free i'm done with the modern world it's giving i'm done with modern world here you're met with a really gorgeous area now when i tell you like i mean come on we don't need a tv to talk okay it's all about spending time and quality time okay look at this we don't we don't need a tv we got each other we have the nectar make love the cute art decor pieces now once you exit out of here okay let's 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 make this a grand exit wow okay wait whoa look how cool that looks so cinematic once you exit out of here you are automatically greeted with this big ass field that you can do absolutely whatever you want Want with your set. Look how gorgeous. Are you kidding me? Super, super pretty. It's time we make our way upstairs. And in this bedroom, we have what? Oh, wow. This is gorgeous. Anytime you have a fireplace and a couch in your bedroom, you're living large. You're living, you're, you're not living like the rest of us. You got a couch in your bedroom, you're living, you're not living like the rest of us. I'm telling you that right now. What's going on? What's going on? You have an option to sleep on a couch inside your bed? Let's talk about it. Look at this view. Hold on. We're not, we're not appreciating this enough. We're not appreciating this. Enough. Are you kidding me? Imagine your Sims taking a shower and they're looking out right here this is stunning are you kidding me wow uh, if you look over here it also has like this little design and i just love the way everything comes across when you come over here you're met with more bedrooms of course you can always have an outer area where you can just walk down and make your way outside your little rocking chair of course look at this little rocking chair that you have to spend 40 dollars as soon as like within the next like what couple of weeks or you can't get this rocking chair with a missing star inside of it wow ea you did that you ate anyway if you come over here we have the primary bedroom wow 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 this sim is living nice again this is called ranch for all animals and it'll be listed down below in the description box now i know some of y'all are probably like yeah not everyone wants this big ass horse ranch i got y'all relax i got you okay so this builder is named mina and when i tell you Chef kisses, okay, because when you ooh, low, okay, right here, how cute is this? Okay, I placed it in the in the chestnut ridge, so I know some of y'all are gonna get on me like, I want more horse chestnut ridge, chestnut ridge. Okay, yeah, got it. Okay, but this is a cute little starter base game home. When I tell you, this is not base game. So sorry, but this is a cute little starter home when it comes down to chestnut red. And look how gorgeous this is. This is so cute. Upon entrance, all I mean, look, there really is nothing to it. It's very, very small and simple and very, I just love it. Like, it's really, really cute for your Sims. And it still has that like room for if you want like a chicken coop or sheep or even just a horse. I mean, you are gonna have to go take your horses outside sometime, okay? So, you know, it's a little tight. But let's take a look at this. And when I tell you guys, this is what I love about builders because I already know when I walk in, I'm about to details, details, details. Now, this person obviously could have just, like, just cleaned up because they knew that we were rolling in. But when I tell you, look how cute and lived in this look. Oh, adorable with the log stove. I don't know. There's just something about the woodsy, like, little small, cute, like, farm aesthetic. I just, I love it. Look at the refrigerator. I mean, everything is just doing what it needs. I love that. And again, this is no CC. People are always like, oh, you need CC to make a really good build. It's a lie. You have clearly have not met the right builders. You clearly have not met the right builders. This is so cute. I will admit, this is one of my favorite pieces from the Horse Ranch expansion pack. I think this really does just give like that you know like when you put the cloth over like the little chairs and stuff like that i think this is really cute so anyway let's go upstairs not the details with the little chicken but once you go upstairs you're automatically met with a bedroom and then of course it's really cute and small now this could be for like maybe a starter home for your sims when you're doing your lps here's a cute little tight knit bathroom i think it's adorable so cute and then on upon exiting y'all i mean yeah it's small but it's still giving money so you gotta view like this in your bedroom as soon as you walk out a whole new world like 
like look at the mountains in the background are you kidding me i would love to live here and you have views of other farms and ranches i mean come on now just seeing your horse live their best life i'm looking look 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 i'm about to blue i'm really thinking about who's doing up into this damn screen and being like take me let me go there if life really is a simulation i'm gonna need my simulator or creator to go ahead and drop some you know, some 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 cheat codes where i can do mother love i have one more build for you guys of course again it's gonna be more on the medium to small side so think like medium house okay so like you want your sims to be like we got the money like if we wanted to we could but also like we're staying humble because again we're living that horse ranch life i got you nolana sims is an amazing when i tell you guys nolana sims amazing i don't care i'm gonna hype up every single builder that i show you guys because i truly mean that they're an amazing talented builders okay so we're gonna take a look at nolana build um okay and when i tell you guys this is it's literally called a modern ranch house and upon entrance all you guys can look i mean you guys can look at it just straight from the right here we have a cute little truck again storyline you can be like your sim maybe even does food trucks you can even like make it to where your sim runs a food truck out here okay oh now when this is live there's gonna be ducks and ponds and you gotta see the vision you gotta see the vision okay and then once you get over here i really like this area because obviously your sims and your horse still has enough room to like you know train and do all those things but as well as you still have this house this house let's 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 dive into it let's let's, let's i'm so excited okay let's, let's start with the shed first i think we should start with the shed because i'm just getting so excited okay so once you um dive deep into the shed of course we are met with what Ooh, okay so we got some like you know little lived in areas over here okay and then we have your little stable again with the aesthetic we have the little wine bar area over here this is cute a little creepy it's giving scary movie but it's cute i love it okay and then you're met over here with your little with your stable okay so like obviously it's enough for what one or so maybe your sim is just i'm starting off this branch life again you gotta be delulu when it comes down to build over here we're met with a little nectar making area where your sim can obviously have a wine place like maybe your sim just make wine like that's what they do they make wine and that's how they make a living and that's how they were able to afford this beautiful big home again gameplay story i love builders because they always include just a little bit enough to where you can be delulu and make a gameplay scenario out of it and just be like okay let's do this. one thing i have to say about i really love about this build is that there is like florida wall like um floor to to ceiling windows glass gorgeous i personally would be a little too scared in real life to have that in my home but in, in a simulation chef kisses when you first walk in you are automatically met with this area over here love this oh is this a skylight i don't know this is a skylight but i love this area it's super cute again i don't have all the packs so maybe something is missing but how would i know how would i really know i wouldn't and if, then if something is missing like maybe a refrigerator that you wanted to put in there just put it on yourself this is a really cute kitchen i love this love the double sink five and again it's still giving like woodsy horse ranch oh wait a minute wait a minute now i'm rubbing my feet as i'm saying that anyway this is so cute i love this i love this with the like with the natural light coming in fireplace and i love that everybody that i've shown you guys so far has not put that many tvs in this horse ranch like you know any of the builds it just it, it just means that like it's about community <gasps> that's not right it's about community Okay, let me stop playing. And then over here, oh, it's a little dark. But we're counting on natural light. Counting on natural light. Once you come upstairs, you're met with, I'm guessing this is gonna be a bathroom. I have a really big feeling. It is gonna be a bed, a bed. Really cute. It's a little dark, but I think it's because, I don't know, I don't have it on play. So I'm not sure what it, what's the reason, but it's okay. Wow. And then over here, of course, you can still like be upstairs, but still have like a little eye on like your horsies and you seeing them playing out in the field, making sure they're air okay. But it's like, who is gonna be jacking? my horse is all the way up here nobody and if you are you're doing too much you're doing way too much and i'm gonna need you to sit down this house is very dependent on natural light but when i tell you this is gorgeous this is what the house looks like from the back and if you place this house here you are also met with big ass beautiful field that you can have your horses or sheep or goats or cows or whatever you choose to have out here and of course if you have the tool mod you're able to really even go more in depth with this again these are the builds that i'm talking about that truly does make a difference when it comes down to the sims 4 with all that being said i hope you guys enjoyed every single one of these builds that i've showed you guys and again i want thank you guys so much i can officially say we are on the road to 30k baby all thanks to you guys i am so why can't i talk all thanks to you guys i'm very grateful for every single one of you whether you're a silent viewer or you share my videos or you click you press like which truly does help out my channel okay it's not like i don't mean to like oh just like leave a like if you like the video no seriously leave a like if you like the video because it truly does help out my channel and on top of that even if you're like a silent viewer and you don't say anything at the end of the day you still support my channel in some kind of way and for that i thank you okay anyway thank you so much for watching and if you guys enjoyed videos like this i have a whole playlist on me touring a bunch of gallery builds and of course i'll be doing more with that being said i'll see you guys all in the next video bye not me hitting that let's do that again i'll see you guys all in the next video bye